Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, I'm Haley, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how much money I make on YouTube. So I was monetized back in November, so I'm going to be showing you guys how much I made on my first YouTube check and how much I've made since being monetized. So before we get started, make sure you go ahead and subscribe to my channel before you leave today. I do post new videos every week. I do a ton of fashion and beauty content and also some lifestyle vlogs. So you want to make sure you stick around and let's go ahead and get into the video. Okay, so before we dive into the numbers and my YouTube like back office, I'm gonna show you guys all that stuff so you'll see like exact figures and everything like that. I just wanna give you guys some context of like a timeline. Um, so I started doing YouTube back in 2017, like in the summer, and I would do like makeup tutorials pretty much just exclusively, but I wasn't consistent at all. I would like go months without posting a video. And then it wasn't until... November, December 2019 that I got really, really serious, started uploading consistently multiple times a week, and I even did Vlogmas um, on De in December 2019, and I would say that that's really when things started to change with YouTube, and I actually started gaining momentum and gaining subscribers. I will say it was a slow burn. I was gaining subscribers, but slowly, and I think when I started Vlogmas, I had maybe 100 subscribers. So I was still really, really small, but that's when I um, saw some major changes happening. And then all through 2020, I was extremely consistent. I think I uploaded over 100 videos, so that's more than two a week. Um, I'm pretty sure it was like 120 something. So I was super, super consistent all of 2020. And November 2020 is when I was able to monetize. So in order to monetize, if you don't know, you have to have 4,000 watch hours in a year span, so 365 days, and 1,000 subscribers. So I just hit that. I'm pretty sure I actually hit it like on my birthday, which was actually really cool. So that's the context of kind of like the timeline of starting my channel becoming consistent, and then getting monetized. So let's go ahead and dive into the numbers. So I have my laptop right here. I don't have like that, you know, that little piece of paper like people hold up that's like, here's my first check. That's not actually like what the check is. It just is direct deposited. Um, I don't know. That's just like basically like your Google AdSense like confirmation like for your account. So I don't have that paper because it doesn't really mean anything. Um, but I do have all of my payment info on my computer right here. So basically, I'm gonna screen record this, so I'll put this up here. Okay, so just to let you guys know, some things might be blurred out just for my own privacy purposes, but I'm gonna show you guys all of the numbers and figures. So this is what it looks like when you first log into your YouTube studio or YouTube back office. So right away it tells you um, over the past 28 days how many views you've had, how many watch time subscribers you've gained, and um, your estimated revenue. So that is what you see right off the bat when you log in. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on revenue. And this just shows you for the past 28 days how much revenue I've made. So I'm gonna go down to November. Okay, so this is just for the month of November. And it shows right here that I made $85.41. So that's really not that bad for only being monetized for two weeks that month. Um, and I think that's pretty good. And then um, the amount you get paid depends on a few things. One, it depends on your playback-based CPM, which I'm pretty sure that means cost per mil. And that basically is just how much advertisers are willing to pay you per thousand views. So I had a pretty high CPM in November. It was $11.53. Mine ranges anywhere from like $8. I think I have one that's up to like $16. And that, honestly, I don't understand thoroughly. I get the gist of it. I know it depends on the content that you're producing, like what category it's in. So like if you're doing like educational or like businessy content. I know it's like a higher CPM and then things that are a little more like maybe inappropriate or just like not as high priority get a lower CPM. So mine is pretty good. It's kind of like smack dab in the middle. It's in that like $10 range, which is what I always aim for. Um, not that I have any control over that, but that's like what I want it to be at. And so my CPM for November was 11.53. And then RPM, I honestly don't even know what that means. I think it's like a smaller version of CPM. 
I don't know. I know that they like affect each other. So yeah. So I was not able to get a physical check for November. Um, in December, you get paid a month later because you have to hit a threshold of $100. I think I've already mentioned that. So my November check was rolled into my December check. So let's go into December. And then Vlogmas, I did, I did Vlogmas this December. So um, I posted a video every single day. And to be honest, I did not see the return on that investment of my time um, just because I simply didn't have enough views to make it worthwhile. The reason that I have most of my money is because I had an older video kind of, I don't want to say blow up, but have a lot of views. I think it's up to like 42,000 views now. So that also depends because you do make money from previous videos. So if I posted a video 10 years ago and it's still getting views, I'm still getting paid those ads, if that makes sense. So sorry if this is kind of confusing. It's a kind of a lot of information to take in, but I'm trying to explain it the best I can and show you like where I made money um, and what made a difference and what didn't. So in December total, just for December, not including the money that I made in November, based on only my views in December, I made $155.43 and my playback based CPM was $12.22. So pretty good. And like I said, I posted like 20 something videos in December and I didn't think like the correlation was there because like in November for two weeks, I almost made $100. So I don't know. But um, anyways, so my check for that, if you add that together is like somewhere between like somewhere around $250. So I thought that was a really good first YouTube check, especially since I don't have that many followers. I had just hit a thousand and I'm not even to 2000 yet. So I was pretty proud of myself for that. I mean, that's like one of my bills taken care of so I'm always happy for that and I mean honestly if I was in this for the money I would have quit a long time ago because honestly you don't make crazy money right away so I was very thankful I thought that was a really good amount for my first YouTube check so let's go ahead to January which I still have not been paid for yet but um, like I said you get paid one month after so I'll expect that check like the last week of February, it's usually around like the 20th or 21st. Um, so let's go to January to see how much I made. And I think I only uploaded four videos in January and I still made $153.56. However, my playback based CPM went down significantly and I, it was only at $9.40. So I'm not really sure why, if that's because I was just really uploading vlogs and didn't have super informational content, um, maybe that could be why. So I'm not 100% sure like what I did to make it go lower, um, but like I said, that just fluctuates all the time. So it's kind of frustrating, but it is what it is. They're the ones that like are choosing to pay me for the ad, so I'm not gonna complain. <laughs> and then I'll show you guys what I've made for February so far. It is only February 16th today. So, so far for February, I've only uploaded two videos and I have made $69.32. And then my CPM is up, so it's at 1017 as of now. It's only two weeks into February, um, so that's where I'm at right now at this moment. And honestly, I think for only uploading two videos so far, that is pretty good. So yeah, that is how much money I made on all my YouTube checks. So you guys have seen ever since I hit monetization how much I've made. And it's been pretty consistent. I would say I'm gonna end February in a similar place. So I can't complain about that, especially since in December I did upload like a crazy amount of times. And to still be hitting in that same dollar amount, I think is pretty good since I've only been uploading once a week, which I'm gonna start uploading more, but honestly, still pretty good. And so thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope that you enjoyed this video. And if you're starting out YouTube, I hope this encourages you to keep going. It's a slow process for most people, but I think it's really rewarding and really fun. So thank you guys again for watching and I will see you in my next one. Bye.